Hi, hello, welcome back to the channel. Today, we are going to review a movie which is all about a teenage boy who works as a lifeguard at the beach and at the same time, he is caring for a large number of women who are coming for the weekend without their husbands. The film is a 1974 romantic comedy drama and the title as Lovers and Other Relatives. Somewhere on the beaches of Tuscany in 1950s, a well pay of family spends their vacations. The old parents, constantly curling, are the least of the problems of their son. Sandro, 16 years old, pubescent, rebelling, spending the days with his friends, playing pranks and starting to get interested in women. However, the only woman he is seriously interested in is the beautiful Laura, the wife of his older brother Renzo. And while Renzo is usually out of business reasons, Sandro and Laura get to spend a lot of time together on the beach. Their relationship is developed rather laxtos until it gets a momentum after the first half. It is not too badly written from then. Most of earlier beach scenes are crazy and felt convincing, not surprising at any point. Initially, Laura doesn't even notice Sandro's interest in her. Then she does, but smiles about it, until she develops feeling of her own. This is actually inevitable in the view of her husband Renzo who is so completely stupid and unbearable wonder that it made marry her him in the first place. Once you consider this, you can see the problem that somewhat limits the characterization of Laura. By gradually understanding the emotion she causes in Sandro, Laura becomes his friend and understanding complex. The adolescent awkwardness also makes him different and endearing male model for her without her daring to admit it. The initiation is therefore above all mental since by experiencing the torment, jealousy and frustration of the lover without being one. Sandro alternates between retreating the macho education on which he is conditional or daring to show a touching vulnerability that does not procure muscularity. Rejected, including by a teenage girlfriend while trying to play the alpha male, he awakens a deeper feelings by crying in spite of Laura even though he offers him his first kiss. The formal settling is the idol for translating this whirlwind of emotion and sensations. In the film, the adult characters, like the couple Laura and Renzo, have fulfilled their adult hinted at by any asserted public tenderness while the adolescent Sandro is more easily exposed to adult culture via magazine and literature and social phenomena of his time. The film is basically a prevision story about an aunt and nephew and the nephew who desires the aunt and does not even accept the occasion with another girl of his age, but aunt who is pretty pathetic in most scenes. 
she goes with every man and she gets and after using the nephew to do all her chores and she gets tired of him and goes with her own life for the actress Laura this is probably the last time she took the role of youthful naive love interest and this is all about this movie review and if you do love our videos please do support us by like share and subscribe thank you